hey guys how is it going welcome back to another video on injustice to mobile all right guys so in the last video i said that i'm going to defeat boss uh, sub-zero and i did that and we're going to watch exactly how i did that in this video all right guys so you know let me just uh, play the recording real quick over here oops all right guys so if you're new to the channel and if you are watching this video for the first time i would like to ask you to please subscribe to the channel and click on the bell notification for further updates on videos just like this all right guys here we go <clears throat> here we go sub-zero i have a uh, zatanna i have uh let's see yeah batman the drone and batman who laughs uh batman who laughs is having a level four no rush, no globe, and level one no rush, no globe is on uh, Zatanna, and uh, Batum and the Drone is having Crown of Conduct. Yeah, there we go. The fire is on, so you need to have fire in order to reverse uh, the freezing uh, effect that you have on your characters. I'm increasing the damage buff over here. It's 45%. Zatanna is doing percentage damage and the reason is because I started with Zatanna as you can see that's what you need to do in order to increase uh, in order to get the uh, percentage damage and increase the damage buff you have to start with your Zatanna in the match okay there we go Zatanna is in And the first hydrokinesis doing some decent damage over there. It's actually quite decent, you know. Take a look at it. 3.4. There we go. There we go again. Percentage damage is dealt by Batman who laughs as well. This is something crazy, man. I, I really enjoyed basically, you know, this fight. Uh, he did percentage damage without hydrokinesis. You know, that is what you need to remember. And this is like kind of a bug or something. I don't know. But he is actually doing percentage damage. Okay. There we go. Burning now. Burning again. Not bad. Super move is on. And take a look at the person this damage once again. Okay, I basically kind of messed up a little bit at the end. But this was a decent pip. Definitely was a decent pip. There we go. Burning again. Percentage damage. Once again, 7 million. Not bad. Ah, okay. That was, that was it. And uh, I really did enjoy this pip, you know. And uh, look at the damage. 366 almost 367 million damage you know that was that was nice now moving on to the next pip loa team including uh you know uh armored supergirl to apply burn so uh you know guys i've also had a played a fight uh, where i haven't used any characters that can apply burn uh you know just to show you guys how exactly it goes when you don't have any burning effect characters or artifact in your you know in your roster and after this match we're going to take a look at that as well Okay. So basically, he cannot be stunned or frozen, uh, but I did some decent damage just with the basic hits over here. Uh, and I have Crown of Conduct on uh, Hardbreaker Harley Quinn. I have a level 4 Nora Snow Globe on uh, Armored Supergirl in the same level 1 Nora Snow Globe on EPI. Okay, there we go. Yeah. It's not a lot. 
Oh, it's not a lot of damage because the stack's not yet up. There we go. There we go again. 21. Now the damage is coming out. Serious damage. Okay, here we go. Special 3 once again. Whoops. Okay, tagging in HBHQ again. And there goes the super move. And we have full stacks of COK. Look at the damage without stunning the opponent, which is crazy. Ah, that was a mistake. There we go. Get yeah, the damage, guys. It's almost like 800k for a basic hit. It's not bad at all. we go yeah that was messed up applying the burn again there we go i did some decent damage actually just with this pip you know without stunning because there is stun immunity on this guy there we go. EPI is in to tank the super move. And she did that. She took that super move pretty well, actually. Oh, not bad. Not bad again. Okay. Hey. Ah, that was that was a mistake. There we go. So that was pip number two, guys. Now this pip I could have used uh, I could have easily used uh, Zatanna's puppet and finished off boss sub zero uh, because Zatanna's puppet can actually burn your opponents. You know, with uh, any particular special two or special three. Uh, you know, you just need to keep doing special attacks until your opponent gets burned, and uh, then you can do your basic hits, do the combos, uh, and it goes on for like 20, 22 seconds but this fight this is what i wanted to show you guys there we go i have raven just for safety you know so that i don't deal less damage i deal more damage so i'm freezing i'm freezing out there but the freeze gets uh you know uh, down eventually you just need to make sure that you don't do a lot of basic hits but just make sure that you do a lot of specials in order to do the damage there we go that's exactly what i'm doing over here Okay, the freeze is there. Okay, that was messed up. There we go. Five stacks again. And my first special three with King, which I messed up. Oh, I laughed a lot about, uh, you know, after watching that special attack. He literally jumped out of nowhere, you know. There we go. Five stacks are still on. It's not the best pip. That i've played i have to say it's not the best one definitely but uh yeah you know when you have a uh, modifier like freeze you got to be careful otherwise you'll just die oh. i gotta put the stacks again it took not a lot of time you know to put the stacks here we go Okay, that was decent for a special three after a long time. Okay, now moving on to the fight. Second special three. I have, uh, I think I have dark metal cards on a uh, king. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot. Yeah, there is, there is the freeze. And he did literally nothing after I froze. So, you know, even if you don't have a character that can apply burn, it's still fine, you know, because uh, eventually you will deal damage uh, even with uh, freeze on. Because it doesn't last for very long, and if you, if your opponent hits you just like this, you know the freeze is gone. You know, so uh, it's not that difficult like it used to be before. You know, with the recent artifacts that we have, 
like Zatanna's puppet and uh, if you have a burning character then it's, if you have a character that can apply burn or an artifact it's great look at the damage 4.5 million on special 3 it's not bad definitely not bad at all 8 million on special 3 take a look at the basic hits I could have finished this off you know if the freeze would have not been there there we go Not bad, 8.6. Actually, not bad. Yeah, at the right, at the end, exactly, I managed to do the super move. But I still have just a little bit of health left on boss sub zero. It was 106k damage done. Now, the main pip is Zatanna. Zatanna's puppet, I'm sorry. On, uh, Age, on Batman Ninja Catwoman, then the rest two characters are having level 4 and level 1 Nora Snow Globe. So this, this was a fun pip. I finished off Sub-Zero in like a few seconds. I think 30, 40 seconds. I don't know. Less than a minute. I know that. So, uh, and, and you know, Zatanna's puppet can actually apply burn for like 20, 22 seconds. That is exactly what I did. There we go. You just need to keep doing your specials. And he started burning right away, you know. I didn't have to do any more specials after that. One more, I think, after this. Uh, in order to do the burn. And then I did some serious damage and then he was dead. So let's let's take a look at that. There we go. Doing some decent damage. The defense has eventually decreased. So what you, what you need to do at this point is just keep doing your specials. Uh, don't do the basic hits. Uh, because you already have enough uh, you know, buffs on debuffs on the opponent to uh, you know, keep the power generation on. There we go. He started burning again and he's almost down guys he's almost down okay one more special three and he's dead there we go less than a minute all right guys now we're going to take a look at the rewards that we're going to get <clears throat> 44 million is not a lot you know all right moving on moving on into the rewards which eventually you guys would know how they are yeah it was not bad actually getting batman ninja robin but you usually get him from the arena every time uh you know so i i think i think it could have been better level eight amulet of arcane is not good at all i have like n number of uh, amulets available right now with me and a lot of them have shattered already all right, so now Deathstroke. The final pip is with Deathstroke. I unfortunately forgot to record my third pip, which was with uh, Silver Banshee. Uh, it didn't do a lot of damage anyway, so. All right, guys. So this was actually a decent pip that I did and I played. So here we go. Begins. So I have uh, applied, I have actually added... Uh, power girl over here instead of a green lantern and just to do a little bit more extra damage you know extra specials get some power generation on dead stroke you know reduce the power cost 43 million not bad that's a percentage damage obviously it's going to be high there we go 41 I wanted my dead stroke to die and I don't think he's dead okay there we go yeah he, he eventually died that's nice I just need to get him and get the opponent in the corner there we go clones are also doing clones are also doing their job exactly what they are for okay there we go another special so i did three special twos with the clone which was actually not bad there we go that's the fourth one and he eventually died okay there we go now she's in the corner now the damage will increase I did a ton of damage, you know, with this clone. I did a, almost all the special twos. And I did a lot of damage because of that. There we go. 
and i was doing the basic hit combos all the full hit combo because of the power generation it's kind of slow and uh, you know power girls uh, power cost reduction doesn't work on the clones so you have to do the basic hits there we go here we go again 27 million still on a special two mm -hmm. not bad not bad again look at the combo interruption guys i think i have mastered the art of combo interruption i've been doing this for a very long time obviously i mean there are a lot of people out there who still face issues with combo interruption i've made a guide actually for that if you guys want to check it out it's there on my channel just search for combo interruption guide how to do combo interruption like a professional you know i think something like that okay i think that was the last special too everything is done now yeah i did that just to save time oh that was a mistake actually there we go not bad ah look at the damage numbers guys look at the damage numbers there are serious damage numbers over here more than 500 million not bad at all definitely not bad at all all right guys so i guess that is it for today's video guys if you enjoyed it give it a like and let's meet again in the next video until then guys you have a great day take care of yourselves be blessed and stay safe have a good one guys Bye bye